actually going to finally take the C8 Corvette out and see how capable it is in the snow. Don, how are you feeling about this? How capable is the C8? It's going to exceed my expectations. <laughs> it's going to exceed your expectations? Yeah. I don't feel the same way, but we'll see how it does. You guys want to see my custom install here? I'll walk you around it real quick and then we'll try and squeeze this out the door here. It's not the car, it's how you drive the car. Ooh. You always say that. Well played, yeah. Did you watch the new Top Gun? It's not the airplane, it's the pilot. So I had a lot of concerns about how I installed this light bar on my target top, and I don't know why, it's my car. But all I did was I fed the wire through here, suction cupped it to the roof with some sea suckers. And then inside the car, we just have a nice custom install. All the wires are hidden. You can't really see anything that's going on, so probably no point showing you inside there. I built this ski box bracket. This was actually originally designed for a Huracan and seems to ironically work well on here. So, um, yeah, we're gonna go check it out. I've got these wheels on here for those wondering. I can't wait to see the comments on this, but yes, there are three wheel spacers stacked up on top of each other. And, uh, yeah, what do you think, Don? You ready? Great. A 17 foot car, not a 22 foot truck. Yeah, I was warming up the tires. Oh, yeah, warming up the tires. I call it a, a tread, tread alignment. No, Jamie, there's a bunch of police cars here. Your, your buddies? Yeah, yeah. So I just wanted to come get a coffee and see if I can maybe get a ticket while I'm here. Sure. Why not? So I like your shirt. Thanks. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna grab a coffee and uh, see what happens. No ticket today. Not I, yet. I even asked for them to write me a ticket. They won't write me a ticket. I think they're on break. Yeah, they're on break. Yeah. Give me your reaction on the wide body winter edition C8 Corvette. Well, it takes a special kind of person to uh, do something like that, uh, I would say. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's special. Cool. My mom said a special. Uh, 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 <laughs> your own kind of special, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, your yeah. own kind of special. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's awesome. What right? do you think the other staff think of it? I think everybody thinks it's cool. It's yeah. cool. I think if you're not going to have a big lifted truck, yep. the best thing, absolute best thing is a C8, like with well, winter tires. I've I, always said, freaking put winter tires on the thing. Yeah. I've Absolutely. said repeatedly, they built these cars for winter. I told Don this morning, heated steering wheel, That's heated right. seats, great heater in it. And you've got now weight on the back. Plus you've got now you get the mid engine. Yeah. There's weight all the way around. And I got tons of wheel spacers to make it work. Absolutely. So I mean, like, crazy I, not to. I think the next thing you should do though is do uh, like tracks or yeah. like, uh, you know, like skis. No, I'm going to twin so, turbo next. Twin turbo. No, but I'm just saying for when it's like, like there's like three feet of snow. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, they, then you can like, you know, ski through. Don had an idea this morning. Don, what was your idea? Oh yeah, the uh, 
Traction boards. Yeah, traction boards. Make it, make it look like it's ready to get stuff. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Mm -hmm. Oh, frick, you should I've never seen it with the light on. You, the last video I saw, you didn't have your, uh, your light bar turned on. Oh yeah, we were driving on the highway on the way here with the light bar on. That'd be pretty bright. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Winter version, all the way in Saskatchewan. You think Americans move snow like that? I'd say something pretty dang unique. Pretty cool? I love it. You I love, love it? that someone's crazy enough to drive this in winter, because that's exactly what I would want. A Canadian winter yet. Absolutely. Right? <laughs> so. The wheels look sick. Yeah, hey, what do you think of the wheel spacers behind the wheels? Can you see that? These gigantic things? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever works, right? You didn't make it through this last week with this thing, did you? No, no, we, we actually went to leave the shop the other day to do the first video. And there was like five feet of snow back and Nathan talked me out of it. So that, uh, <laughs> that was short lived, but. Okay, so you can be convinced about a couple of things, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, well, once we started ca talking cost of rear bumper, I kind of deci decided not to do it, but yeah. You got the red mirrors even matching. It. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And the CHR, even though it's not an R, but I actually want to change the R to a T because it's going to be turbo, C A T. You like that? There you yeah. go. Yeah, so. There you go. Anyway, yeah. Light bar and everything. Look at right? You. Yeah. Like, what else would you do? <laughs> and so, yeah, it's the Winter Edition C8 Corvette. This is amazing. Amazing. Where's, your, where's your Audi TT? <laughs> She's down in Ontario right now. Oh, okay. Yeah, because... I decided to maximize on the market. Oh, you sold it. And uh, I'm kicking myself already. For oh, it. I didn't even know you sold it. All right. Cool. Yeah. 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 Cool, man. Well, dude, love it. Love awesome. it. some of that today. So maybe winter edition C8 Corvette shouldn't be lowered <laughs> two inches? Yeah. <laughs> Didn't know he thought that one out. Yeah, it wasn't well thought out plan. Sound of progress. Yeah, I'm clearing the street. <laughs> this is a Saturday. This is a Saturday. So this is uh, cruising in a lowered wide-body C8. Yeah. yeah. Canadian edition. Everything they said it would be and more. <laughs> It's, uh, it's doing better than I thought. Actually, you know what I find? Like, a lot of these mid-engine cars, if you put winter tires on them, they do pretty good. Like, I haven't been using traction control. It's been doing fine, right? Yeah, no, it's been... You've been in control. Yeah, no, that's never felt out of control anyway. No, it's just these, uh, these ruts. This is fine. This isn't bad here. But when you're scooping everything up... When it's spraying all over the windshield, yeah. Yeah. But it's kind of fun. <laughs> So overall, it went pretty good, Nathan. I think so. Yeah, Jamie. It's good. It's good. Yeah, it's cold. A little bit of carnage there. I I thought it was ice, but maybe it's under the PPF. I think it's under the PPF. I think I heard that. Did you guys see the snow spraying up over the head? Yes. It was like just pouring up here, and uh, a little bit of snow there. This wheel is packed pretty good with some snow. That's our vibration right there, I guess. And uh, 
overall. I think we should, think we should do it again. We should do it when we get a bit of snow, I think. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Grab a quick montage of it and we'll shut her down. <laughs> Hey Jamie, so you saw Naweed out there, right? I did, yeah. So Naweed sent me a cool picture of my car going on the road. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's it guys, I hope you enjoyed it. I think overall the reactions we had from the car and what people thought of it as a winter car went over pretty well. And uh, I don't know what you guys think, let me know. We got some epic shots, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope to see you on the next one. Thanks for watching, peace. Uh -huh.